Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Daily Duels. Today is Tuesday, it means we're using another Stellanite deck. So as you can tell by the title, we're using Tiago's. I don't know. You know, say, when are you going to do mine? It, it's much easier for me to go ahead and, you know, these people have sent me the file, the actual file. So it's much easier for me to just hop on and do the recording. Uh, for those of you who, of course, have, uh, you know, uh, submitted a deck, I will be doing your deck eventually. I just got to go ahead and create the deck on, you know, on... On uh, here on Dev Pro, put all the cards and stuff, etc., etc. So, uh, yeah. But don't worry, don't worry. Your video will uh, be up here eventually. So, yes, we're using Tago, so just like in good old fashioned uh, set precedence, even though it's only been one video, we are going to go ahead and play a couple duels. And then when I see that the video is long enough, I'll go ahead and do the deck profile and talk about what I liked about the deck, what I didn't like about the deck, etc., etc. And uh, some general ideas that I, that the deck has inspired me to do, so you know, some, some new ideas. So, uh, so far, it's kind of like uh, the deck that I was using before, you know. Uh, he decided to go with the Fire and Ice Hands, uh, put additional pressure on your opponent while still having level 4 to go ahead and make C with. is uh, a fun idea, looks like we're going up against 6 Bamurai, so of course he is going to summon his Xian, and I am going to warning it, and then the salt will rain from the skies. <laughs> <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> yeah, I was like, of course I get the solemn warning. Yes, I do. Because, <laughs> you know, you know, you know, Sunday's video, what, what I talk about, what I talk about, exactly what I talk about. Go ahead, use this effect. Nah, that's fine too. I'm not worried about that. I'm not worried about that. Yep. No, I don't care about Dark Yam. <clears throat> I can handle that by myself. Ouch! You took my thousand that you gave me back! No! Impossible! Alright. That's dull stuff. Not in a hurry. It's not like my opponent is gonna wail on my ass. I'm, like I said, I'm waiting for that Shien. That's what I want. I want that Shien. I don't care about Bakyan. I don't give no fucks about Bakyan. I'm about to kill it right now. But I, I want him to be like, I summon Shien, the most powerful thing. Did I go warning? Uh, no. Because you don't control another face up six samurai. Oh, now you do. Okay. <sighs> You could only you can just suck one monster on the field and destroy it. Yeah, warning that. No. Yeah. Yeah. I don't want a warning it, but I'm a warning it. Fuck your double sword technique. I was like, yeah, I can't have him having all the monsters. It's not, it's not healthy for me right now. I, I can't eat him. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. Wow, he's got all the keys on. He's like, I get keys on. Uh-huh. Yep. Um. Yeah, go ahead and handle the Barkeon. Oh, yeah. Something by one little ice hand. Actually, you know what? I should have destroyed the keys on. Yeah, I should have destroyed the keys on. That was my bad. Oh well, I miss playing. Is that some background? God, I'm just drawing all the hands. Well, uh, that's my luck. I would love to draw other shit, not the hands, but it's cool. Let me guess, now he actually has something for my ass, right? 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 Like... God, like, what's up with all the hands? Like, draw all the hands. Like, they're supposed to help me, and now they're just hindering my plays. Like, out the ass. Go ahead and play your fucking whatever. I don't care. Oh, yeah. You got a response to that. If you got a response, play it. Yes. Got a response to this. 
No. Okay. Give me Altair. Who the fuck should I take out? I should take out... I should take out his monsters. Because I don't want him to use this to tribute to pop me, but then I don't want him to get another 4 and then XC, so... I might have to take the back row on the chin and risk the play. So, of course, you got my favorite Delta. So, yeah. Let me take out these two. Actually, I should have destroyed uh, the keys on. There. No, I didn't want him to do that or do that. I didn't want neither one of them. If he summons a level 4 and then starts to summon the key down, then hey, more power to you. So what is this, another uh, sword technique? Double sword technique, is that what it is? Another one? I wouldn't be surprised. I wouldn't be shocked. So far, you opened up pretty well. Elder? And then what? And then what? Zanji. Okay, so you're gonna crash into me and then use your effect. The f oh, you're gonna use your effect to protect yourself. Okay. At the end of the damage step, this card was attacked to show the monster that this card attacked you and control another face of six samurai to resolve this effect but you didn't you know, this effect with a different name to activate and resolve this effect this card will show you can show it how come that didn't destroy me okay hmm I don't know I don't know we'll get a different duel in you guys will probably explain to me in the comments I don't know why he didn't destroy that was a six samurai right other six samurai he attacked I guess, I guess when he used its effect to protect himself, he didn't have the face-up six samurai at the end of the damage tap, or I don't know, I don't know. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and get another duel and bear back. Alright, so let's try this again. Hopefully I don't open up with all the hands and go into all the hands. I drew into one hand, okay. Who's going first, you or me? Me? Yeah, me. Cool, I don't mind. No mind. No mind. Totally don't mind going first. Setup is important. Gonna give me a Vega. Then I can go for my boss ass bitch next next uh, turn. I just said tell you and pass two Yungs. So what are we going against this time? Amazonus. Okay, no, it's fine. I don't care. Supply. Okay. I don't like the idea of that either, but sure. Saved. Then the damage of this card is attacker attack is still on the field with target one spell and a trap hard bone controls and try to target. Man, fuck. Mm-hmm. I didn't want that to happen, but fuck. <laughs> BLS. Well I don't have any darts. Alright, so. Go ahead and go with our play. Altair. Altair. Summon the Neb. The Neb. Go ahead and search me for another Altair. And I will go ahead and summon my boss monster. I want to take out both of these. Do I battle about card effect, especially one of ah. I don't want him to have neither one of them cards. Neither one of them. 
I prefer that he would have neither. I'd rather I'd rather him draw a card, and then special summon from his deck, and then summon and make a one on one or something. You know. So, yeah, that's the choice I decided to go with. I would love to get rid of both of them. All right, another supply squad. All right. It actually might be best if you go ahead and ram your uh, you know, monster enemy because you'll get the plus. Kage. Ooh, that works. So I can summon you, Shin Kage, summon, uh, make another one. Yep. Yes. Yes. Another Altair. We'll make double delta, of course. Yeah, double delta. Then we'll blow up the two supply squads. I don't care about the monster, unless it's fucking Fossidina. Like, if it's Fossidina, I'm gonna eat my damn hat. But if it's not, then I really don't care, and I seriously doubt it is. Definitely get rid of those two. I don't need you plusing for being bad. Okay. We'll get another duel in. Be right back. Alright. This will probably be the last duel. Hmm. You're going first? Okay. That's fine. Thank you. Sure. What are we going against? Quacky Miru? Budens. Ew. Okay. I forgot people still played that deck. That, that deck was kind of done with. The fuck? Who is that? Mm. Alright, bad boogins. <laughs> bad boogins. <laughs> like, A, why would you add that? B, why would you discard that? Like, mm 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 mm. Of course, give me the net. Like, out of all cards to. Mm. You're bad, you should feel bad. You got the bottomless? I'm coming after that Ashi motto. I want it. I like Susan, I want you. Go ahead and play a crane, I don't care. I'll take the damage. Yup. Especially since Turtle got a rod and he can't activate during the damage step. Oh, hell yeah. Hands fuck, get fucked up. Get fisted. Get this hand job. So two of these and pass to you, sir. What was your face down? MST? Hmm, no. Bad boots. <laughs> like, what was that? Like, add, I think that was Raven? Crow, crow. What's this say? <laughs> Why didn't he use Crow? That was dumb. You should have used Crow. <laughs> you should have used Crow to block my attack. Then you wouldn't have had to least out your motto on the field. Hell yeah. Get rid of that. Oh, it was Mirror Force. Cute. Oh, that top deck MST too strong. Hell yeah, I'm gonna throw it at it. I'm about to I'm about to do some play, so I don't want you in my way, please. You wanna chain it, go ahead. I don't care. Oh ha no. Alright. Neb. Neb of course search me for some Vega. Unless you wanna play Valor. We got something. You got some kind of play. Go ahead and play it if you want to. I don't care. No? Okay. Fun. Cool. There you go. I get it. 
Uh, 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 Ragnar Zero, over dick. Yes, Ragnar Zero, hell fucking yes, yes. Cause I'm a blunt cunt like that, hell yeah. Summon your fucking Yamato. You're a beast, right? Oh, you're a wing. Oh, sure. You're a fucking idiot. You're so bad. <laughs> Why are you so bad? Like, oh, my God. You're just doing wrong. Like, you're just bad. Like, bad, bad, bad. You could have been doing way better in this duel than you're, what you're currently doing. So go ahead. Summon your fucking Yamato. My style of tanky so much. Turtle, no. The only problem is I can't detach uh, the neb right now. That's the only problem right now, but you know what? It's still funny. Still funny. That was just. Mm. Mm 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 mm. Mm hmm. No, wiretap. I don't like wiretaps. They usually come a turn too late, and I don't like that shit. So at least it can block me now. Yep, I knew it. Alright, I'm done. So let's go ahead and go to the deck profile and tell what I like and what I don't like. We're back. Alright, so here is uh, Tiago's deck. So let's go through it. So of course he runs... Well, not of course. He runs the 1 BLS. And I really don't feel like his dark count is really high enough unless you go to some XCs. Now, I kind of feel like if you wanted to you know, pull off some more dark plays, maybe go with the Butter Spy to help you with some darks since your dark and light ratio is really not good enough. So you can clearly see in that duel, I didn't have any darks at the time. Nope, did not have any darks at the time. Uh, I guess I kind of switched one with King of Fire Lamp, but I think King of Fire Lamp is also dark, yeah, but, yeah. I shouldn't have to see to get some darks. Uh, we run one, uh, Unokahal, alright, that's fine. Uh, I guess for your Call of the Haunted. Kind of feel if you want to run, uh, him, you should be running, like, maybe, uh, some Warrior Returning Alive just to make him worth it a little bit more. Run, of course, three Altairs, three Denebs, and three Vega, that's fine. Fire and Ice Hand are not next to each other. I don't know why it looks weird, but uh, for this deck, I probably won't go with Fire and Ice Hand just because uh, it's supposed to be more of a fun deck, and uh, I don't want to get another play set of Fire and Ice Hands. <laughs> so I doubt the my deck that I make in real life will have Fire and Ice Hand, but um, they do help. Put additional pressure on your opponent. They're also forwards. You can go ahead and exceed with them. So yeah, uh, I run the one on this because this deck is light, of course. The three Kage for the dark and also the additional uh, helper, of course. And that's the monster. So of course, double row to dark hole. Sure, two pots. Not a big fan of pot, but sure. I guess you go pot with uh, Deneb and sure. Uh, three MSTs, of course. Love three MSTs. Bottomless, Toronto, Compulse, and Warning. The All four of them. Fantastic Four. <laughs> and then, uh, two breakthrough skill. So, the deck only ran two breakthrough skill, and I don't two breakthrough skill. Man, that sounds about right. Uh, two wiretap. Not a big fan of wiretap. Probably won't be running it. Probably not in my deck, because I'm not liking wiretap. I ended up taking it almost every deck, because it's just... <sighs> when you get it, it doesn't do much, and if you don't get it at the right, right time, it's not that good, and you top deck it at the wrong time, it's terrible, so, yeah. And then, of course, three column hunts, it's like those. Alright, extra deck. The one or above, it's fine. Three Delta, um, still debating between two and three, but I don't mind having the three, third one. Uh, depends on the rim of the extra deck and how much the other cards are being played. Ragna is not as good, but it was, I guess it was going to be good against that Blue Empire, so yeah. Sure, one Omega is fine. King of Realms to start to have the Kage is okay. Uh, Castell is great, sure. Uh, Exoton, level the chain to go ahead and, uh, you know, either sense the graveyard or most of the time put a monster on top of the deck. Uh, Emerald to recycle. Dweller because he's good. Cowboy because he's good. And Berserker because he's good. So, uh, what did I learn from this deck that I'll be taking to uh, my deck and taking into consideration? Nothing. Nothing. It, 
It, this deck's not much different than the deck that I first made when, uh, uh, when it was single, when I decided to go ahead and, uh, stop the tagging with Thiago and switch to another day that first day. Not much difference. I was already in the hands, I was already running some macro, so, nope, not much difference. So I didn't learn anything from this deck, but, uh, thank you anyway. Besides that, you, you know, BLS, but needs needs some more dark. Needs some more dark. If you would have threw in the Kage's and the 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 Butter Spice, then you would have had money darks as almost as many lights. So you know, it would have balanced itself out. So I say, if you're gonna go the BLS route, I think you should run those too. All right. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this uh, deck profile. Thank you, Tago, and uh, uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. If you haven't already, be sure to go ahead and uh, send me your Satella decks, and they will of course make an appearance on uh, Daily Duels. So thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for all support, and I will see you guys tomorrow using Murrells, probably joined by Slate. Thanks for watching.